In functional analysis, the open mapping theorem, also known as the banach schauder theorem named after Stefan Banach and Julius Schauder, is a fundamental result which states that if a continuous linear operator between Banach spaces is surjective then it is an open map. More precisely, Rudin 1973, Theorem 2.11, Open mapping theorem. If X and Y are Banach spaces and A, X, Y is a surjective continuous linear operator, then A is an open map, i.e., if U is an open set in X, then A U is open in Y. One proof uses Baer's category theorem, and completeness of both X and Y is essential to the theorem. The statement of the theorem is no longer true if either space is just assumed to be a normed space, but is true if X and Y are taken to be Frechet spaces. Consequences The open mapping theorem has several important consequences. If A, X, Y is a bijective continuous linear operator between the Banach spaces X and Y, then the inverse operator A minus 1, Y X is continuous as well this is called the bounded inverse theorem, Rudin 1973, corollary 2. 12. If A, X, Y is a linear operator between the Banach spaces X and Y, and if for every sequence Xn in X with Xn 0 and Axn Y it follows that Y equals 0, then A is continuous the closed graph theorem. Rudin 1973, Theorem 2. 15 equals Topic Proof equals Suppose A, X, Y is a surjective continuous linear operator. In order to prove that A is an open map, it is sufficient to show that A maps the open unit ball in X to a neighborhood of the origin of Y. Let U equals B one X zero V equals B one Y zero Display style u equals b underscore one carrot x zero v equals b underscore one carrot y zero. Then x equals k element of n k u. Display style x equals big cup underscore k in math b n q. Since a is surjective, y equals a x equals a k element of n k. U equals K element of N A K U Display style Y equals A X equals A left big cup underscore K in Math B N Q right equals big cup underscore K in Math B N A Q But Y is Banach so by Bear's category theorem K element of N A K 
u does not equal display style exists k in math b n q quad left overline a q right caret circ n e q var nothing that is we have c in y and r greater than zero such that b r c a k u a k u display style b underscore r c subsetec left overline a q right caret circ subsetec overline a q let v element of v then c c plus r v element of b r c a k u Display style C, C plus R V in B underscore R C subsetec overline a ku. By continuity of addition and linearity, the difference R V satisfies R V element of A K U plus a k u a k u plus a k u a 2 k u Display style R V in overline a ku plus overline a ku subsetec overline a ku plus a ku subsetec overline a two ku and by linearity again V A L U Display style v subsetec overline a left lu right, where we have set l equals 2 k r. It follows that y element of y epsilon greater than zero, x element of x x x l y y and y minus a x y epsilon one display style for all y in y for all var epsilon greater than zero exists x in x q quad x underscore x l e q l y underscore y quad text and quad y x underscore y. Our next goal is to show that v a two l u. Let y element of v by one. There is some x one with x one. Assume x n l two n minus one and y minus a x one plus x two plus plus x n one two n two display style x underscore n q quad two. Then by one we can pick x n plus one so that x n plus one l two n and y minus a x one plus x two plus plus x n minus a x n plus one one two n plus one display style x underscore n plus one so two is satisfied for x n plus one. Let S n equals x one plus x two plus plus x n. Display style S underscore n equals x underscore one plus x underscore two plus C D O T S plus x underscore n. From the first inequality in two, S n is a Cauchy sequence, and since x is complete, S n converges to some x element of x. 
by 2, the sequence ASN tends to Y, and so X equals Y by continuity of A. Also, x equals lim n infinity s n n equals one infinity x n two l display style x equals lim underscore n to inf t s underscore n l e q sum underscore n equals one caret inf t x underscore n. This shows that y belongs to a two l u, so v a two l u as claimed. Thus the image A U of the unit ball in X contains the open ball V, 2L of Y hence, A U is a neighborhood of zero in Y, and this concludes the proof. <laughs> Generalizations Local convexity of X or Y is not essential to the proof, but completeness as the theorem remains true in the case when X and Y are F spaces. Furthermore, the theorem can be combined with the bare category theorem in the following manner Rudin, theorem 2.11 let X be a F space and Y a topological vector space. If A, X, Y is a continuous linear operator, then either A X is a meager set in Y, or A X equals Y in the latter case, A is an open mapping and Y is also an F space. Furthermore, in this latter case, if N is the kernel of A, then there is a canonical factorization of A in the form X X N alpha y display style x to x n over set alpha to y, where x n is the quotient space, also an f space of x by the closed subspace n. The quotient mapping x x n is open, and the mapping alpha is an isomorphism of topological vector spaces. Dudone, 12.16.8. The open mapping theorem can also be stated as Let X and Y be two F spaces. Then every continuous linear map of X onto Y is a TV's homomorphism, where a linear map U, X, Y is a topological vector space TV's homomorphism if the induced map U caret X Kerr U Y Display style hat U X Kerr U to Y is a TV's isomorphism onto its image. Topic See also Open mapping theorem complex analysis